Do a few stocks have the power to really change your life? As we uncover the mysteries of strategic investing and demonstrate how it might transform your financial circumstances, stay tuned. Tommy is a seasoned investor with a knack for uncovering undiscovered gains in the stock market. He'll serve as our day's guide. We'll also discuss his ideas on how 10 carefully selected stocks can guarantee your financial independence and change your life. Let's start this video by clicking the like and subscribe buttons on Tesla Stock News. You should not miss this. The energy sector is undergoing a significant transformation from only a few years ago. Tony's pioneering work has shown the way forward and has the capacity to fundamentally alter the way that we produce, store, and utilize energy. Coal has reached all-time lows in value, signaling the end of its heyday. Natural gas, which was once believed to hold the key to a cleaner future, has been superseded by solar energy, coupled with advanced battery storage, which is more affordable and environmentally friendly. Tony has made a really groundbreaking revelation. The energy landscape has undergone a dramatic shift, with solar energy becoming more affordable than natural gas because of its rapidly dropping costs. This data validates Bob Dylan's famous quote, the times they are a-changin'. Being at the vanguard of this transformative period puts Tesla in a prime position to benefit from this significant shift. It is important to recognize that historically, analysts of the energy sector have often underestimated the importance of data and market movements over the preceding 10 years. This undervaluation has led to an overvaluation of traditional energy assets. It's amazing how quickly things are changing. Half of the U.S. energy fleet has been retired and replaced. According to Tony's analysis, compared to their predecessors, these energy sources, which include wind and solar, are more environmentally friendly and efficient. They also provide less expensive options. The concept of supply and demand matching sets this apart from traditional energy generation. Assume you are the owner of a power plant with 100 megawatts of capacity, but the demand is only roughly equal to 50 megawatts. Surprisingly, not much has changed in terms of the fixed costs. This is where solar energy proves to be an affordable and sustainable alternative to traditional energy sources when paired with just four hours of storage. Tony's analysis indicates that clean energy will be economical in the long run in addition to being sustainable. It's important to understand, however, that fixed costs such as land acquisition, mining, and infrastructure account for the majority of spending in the energy sector. The entire cost of constructing and running the power plant is relatively constant, regardless of output minus 50, 60, or 100 megawatts. This highlights an important aspect of the energy transition. Now let's take a closer look at the levelized cost of energy, LCOE. In the field of energy, this figure is significant. The plant's life cycle running expenses are calculated using sold energy, not produced energy. Tony has pointed up a significant discrepancy in this calculation. Experts like Adam Dore and the Think Tank Rethink have pointed out that the primary issue is that analysts frequently believe that traditional power sources have an 85% demand rate, when in fact the real figure is far lower and still declining. There are extensive ramifications when the actual and predicted levels of demand diverge. Batteries are helpful, but traditional methods are becoming less necessary as renewable energy sources like solar and wind continue to perform better. This drop in demand significantly increases the LCOE because it is now the cost to construct and run the plant that is influencing the calculation. Illustrating the advantages of localized energy generation also requires acknowledging the losses associated with energy transfer. Let's contrast wind with solar energy. Wind turbines require space, however they can be placed strategically in various locations, such as farms, closer to the needed energy supply. Solar energy is an even more impressive illustration. Anybody can decide to install solar panels on their roof because of advancements in technology. Purchasing solar panels for your own rooftop is starting to become a more cost-effective option than purchasing power from the grid. If you select this option, electricity is generated on your roof in the vicinity and used within your house or to charge your electric vehicle. Now, if we take a little broader view, think about the process of building a new power plant for a utility company such as Georgia Power.
As soon as the solar panels can be constructed and installed, a few acres of land can be selected and quickly put into use. This process just takes a few months, as opposed to the years that traditionally be highly expensive and time consuming. A much more flexible and efficient solution would be to set up one or more solar farms nearby. When necessary, capacity can be progressively raised to keep up with the town's expansion. When paired with battery storage, wind and solar electricity can offer unparalleled flexibility. It is significantly easier to increase wind and solar energy production gradually than to build a large conventional power plant. This results in a more dispersed grid, which is advantageous. As energy generation grows more concentrated, the grid becomes more resilient. This was evident in the Texas event, where the whole infrastructure of the state collapsed. Preventing extensive power disruptions requires decentralization. So, what does all of this mean for fossil fuels and nuclear power? They come to realize that they are stuck in an unbreakable cycle. As alternative power sources become more competitive, the need for conventional power sources decreases. Therefore, lesser revenue leads to higher prices. But conventional power plants have large fixed costs that are unavoidable, so these higher prices are ascribed to them regardless of how much energy they generate. This initiates a self-perpetuating cycle that gets harder and harder to break. In addition, the prices of producing and extracting nuclear electricity and fossil fuels are constantly and often rising. These resources need more energy and are harder to mine as reserves run out. In stark contrast, wind and solar technologies are becoming more affordable and are evolving more swiftly. Battery storage, which is used to store and distribute sporadic energy, is another area where this tendency is evident. Wright's Law, which claims that every doubling of production results in a cost decrease that fosters innovation, is consistent with this pattern. This transformation in the energy scene has significant implications for automobiles with conventional internal combustion engines. Over time, the cost of oil and gas will rise steadily. Actually, there may be existential problems with the fundamentals of these industries. Conventional energy sources are finite, and production and extraction costs will almost certainly rise sharply as reserves deplete. Now is the time to fully focus on Tesla, the business that is positioned to benefit from this energy revolution. The success story of Tesla can be summed up in one word. Batteries. Batteries and solar energy are the mainstays of Tesla's energy strategy. These technologies are becoming more and more affordable while expanding at an astounding rate. Natural gas, which was the least expensive fossil fuel for producing energy until recently, is expected to be surpassed by solar and batteries. Rinkus claims that solar energy combined with just four hours of battery storage is already more affordable than natural gas, a truly amazing breakthrough. The economic potential of renewable energy sources, particularly solar energy combined with better batteries, is undeniable. The energy products and software offered by Tesla are state-of-the-art. Tesla is making it possible for energy providers and consumers to make money while they sleep thanks to a concept called energy arbitrage. This means purchasing energy at a reduced cost and reselling it to the grid when demand and price are at their highest. Through the utilization of clean energy, Tesla is effectively contributing to the conversion of homes into small-scale power plants. Moreover, the design of Tesla's electric vehicles allows unparalleled adaptability. Unlike internal combustion engines, which are limited to using a single fuel type, electric vehicles can acquire their electrons from coal, natural gas, nuclear, hydro, or solar electricity. EVs are adaptable. But here's where the real magic happens. Electric vehicles are adaptable and progressive. Imagine a day when novel energy sources, such as nuclear fusion, are feasible. Despite the fact that this sounds like science fiction, Recent years have seen a considerable advancement in this field of study and development. If fusion power becomes a reality, EVs can readily adapt to employ this cutting-edge technology, ensuring that they remain at the forefront of energy innovation. Essentially, Tesla's goals extend much beyond the production of electric vehicles. In this future energy landscape, which Tesla envisions, people will be able to experience the comforts and conveniences of driving electric cars while also having more flexibility, decentralization, 
localized energy generation and consumption, and the ability to purchase and sell energy through battery storage. This idea perfectly aligns with Tesla's main objective. It promotes Tesla as an energy solutions provider and raises the company above the level of a car maker. Not content to dominate the electric vehicle market, Tesla wants to completely change how the world generates and consumes energy. Tesla is aggressively working to create a more sustainable and eco-friendly future. As a result, Tesla has strengthened its position as one of the largest firms in the stock market, with a market valuation of about $600 billion. What makes Tesla's stock so intriguing is how it has defied accepted wisdom and accepted standards for pricing. Although Tesla's value has periodically baffled analysts and investors, it's critical to remember that Tesla isn't your typical automaker. It presents the energy and transportation of the future. Innovation, technology, and a dedication to sustainability are what drive this company. Although there has been fluctuation in Tesla's stock, the trend has been upward continuously. Early investors have reaped substantial rewards from this growing trend. Tesla's path from its 2010 initial public offering to its current status as a market leader has been amazing. 